English Speaking Course. Hello everyone! Welcome to English Speaking Course. In this video, you will listen to some daily English conversations. Each conversation will give you some lessons to improve your listening and speaking skills. Remember, you can watch the video many times to practice your English. Now, let's get started. Hello, everyone. Today, we will practice reading and listening skills with a story. First, you will watch and listen to the story. After that, you will answer the questions related to the story. Try to find the correct answer and read it out loud. Are you ready? Let's go. Lucy, are you there? <laughs> What's up? You won't believe what happened. How come? I broke up with Jack. I don't even want to call him my boyfriend because he's a real jerk. Are you listening to me? Oh, come on. This is not the first time you've broken up. But this time is totally different. Jack, he betrayed me. He was cheating on me the entire time. All right, all right, calm down. I can't, Lucy. I don't deserve to be like this. Why do you just keep scrolling on your phone? Did you listen to me at all? I am, I'm all ears. And I have something more interesting than Jack. Spending nights in Greece. Yeah, and look at the price. Don't you think they're great deals if we book them now? One of the best ways to move on from a toxic relationship is to go traveling, Sophia. Let's pay no heed to that jerk and upgrade yourself. Is it worth a try? Why not? It's much better than wasting your tears on him. And who knows? You might find a new lover while traveling there. Hmm. Sounds convincing. Imagine you can experience many exciting activities there. You'll soon forget that jerk. Okay, let's meet the travel agent. Hooray! OMG! Unbelievable! How could you book such a stunning room like this, Lucy? I know, right? I chose the ocean view for us. We can watch the sunrise in our room, which is fantastic. I love it. Let's take our very first picture together. Say cheese. I feel like we're traveling first class. Well, we are. Do you want to walk around before we eat? Yes, of course. Shall we go to the solarium? Oh my goodness, are we in paradise now? I want to soak in the water right away. We will, after lunch. I just can't wait to swim in there and enjoy the party. What a soothing place. Sophia, look. Those guys over there have been staring at us this entire time. Gosh, one of them is winking at us. Ugh. I don't think they have good intentions. Are they coming to our place? Sophia, take this chance. It's your time to find a boyfriend in this paradise. Well, I don't prefer any of them. All yours. Enjoy, girl. Bye. Hey, Sophia, wait. Hey, lady, are you all right? Oh, sorry, I'm okay. Well, you look like you're drunk. No, I haven't drunk anything yet. But you look quite sad. I can tell that in your eyes. Oops. Oh, you just brought my feelings to light. Is it rude to ask you what happened? Oh, wait, I forgot to introduce myself. I'm Evan. I'm Sophia. 
and I wouldn't mind sharing with you at all. Actually, I just broke up with my boyfriend a week ago. No kidding, me too! Wait, what? Well, my girlfriend also left me exactly a week ago, so I decided to go on a cruise to refresh my mind. Same here. My friend was also convinced to go traveling and get over my toxic relationship. But I can tell she doesn't care about my feelings at all. She just wants to have fun, I guess. I can feel you, although I always travel alone. Gradually, I've thought that being alone is not that bad. I seem to long for peace and solitude. Is it because you're too tired of this noisy world? Maybe you're right. After several times being heartbroken, I realize I don't enjoy crowds that much. Somehow, I can get what you mean. I saw you standing with a strange guy, is that right? Yes, it was Evan. We just met each other today. And he was really nice to me. Well, I guess you finally found someone to heal your heart. Did you guys decide to keep in touch with each other? Well, I didn't ask for his contact. Gosh, you forgot? I was too awkward to ask, and I felt like he didn't want to keep in touch with me. Oh, come on. If you don't try, how do you know? Never mind. I did enjoy spending time with him, though. I felt like you were the main characters in the Titanic movie. And I hope the ship didn't sink to the bottom of the sea. I'm speechless. Guess what? We have a new neighbor. Really? I hope they won't make any loud noises like the former family. It's a guy. He's watering the plants in the garden and he seems nice. You can go outside and say hello to him. Hold on. Evan? Sophia! Wow! I was taken aback the moment I saw you. Well, I guess we are meant for each other. That's the end of today's story. Now, there will be some questions about the story. You need to read the questions and choose the correct answer. You can pause to think or watch the video again to get the correct answer. And remember to read your answer out loud to practice your speaking skills. Let's get started. Number one, what happened between Sophia and Jack? B, they broke up. Number two, what did Lucy suggest to Sophia to help her move on from her toxic relationship? The answer is A, to go on a trip to Greece. Number three, what type of room did Lucy choose for them on the cruise? A, ocean view. Number four, who did Sophia meet on the cruise and what did they have in common? It's C, Evan, and they both recently went through a breakup. Number five, did Sophia ask for Evan's contact information? Answer, B, no she did not. And that was today's lesson. How do you feel after practicing your skills? How many questions did you get right? Comment your result down below. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Don't forget to practice your English every day to improve your English level.
Watch the video for one week. Try to think and speak in English every time. Listen and repeat the lesson out loud to improve your listening and speaking skills fast. Thanks for watching. Please give us a like, share, and comment. Click here for more useful videos.